Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying some new Nature Valley Savory Bars. Uh, this is the uh, White Cheddar. And I have the Smoky Barbecue and the Everything Bagel. These were $4.29 each at Kroger. You have five bars. And yeah, it says uh, Savory Nut Crunch. They are crispy nut bars. Uh, yeah, five bars of the White Cheddar. I'm sure when we open these, you can easily have gotten six of them. Oh, probably. Maybe even eight. Oh, wow. Yeah, definitely. Definitely. So the boxes are that size just to stand out on the shelf. Yes. Literally, there's there's tons of room in here. You, yeah, absolutely. You could have gotten more. And they're skinny. Yes, the boxes made to stand out for sure. Uh, so it okay. says, wow. Uh, oh, wow. Smells yeah. Good. Oh, wow's right. It says uh, distributed by General Mills. It's a product of Canada. Um, it has roasted peanuts as the number one ingredient. Roasted peanuts, rice flour, there's cheddar cheese, there is dehydrated garlic, dehydrated onion, spice. Hmm. I would have never said white cheddar. No. I but get the I would peanut. say peanut. Yeah, mm -hmm. I get peanut and I get the other seasonings, like a little bit of garlic and onion powder. Mm-hmm. I wouldn't say cheese though. Um I think you get a little bit of a a garlic. Mm-hmm. I get garlic. Um, I get a little bit of onion. Yeah, a little bit of the garlic, a little bit of the onion. And the peanut. The mm -hmm. peanut, it's the first ingredient. It is definitely the thing you taste the most. Is there like a puffed rice or a wheat or oats or something? There's something else in there. Oh, uh, barley. Maybe that, uh, there's something else still in that. It's not just all peanuts. There's oh, something else well, there. it says roasted peanuts, rice flour, sunflower seeds, mm -hmm. uh, sugar, canola oil, cheddar cheese, salt, natural flavor, soy, whatever, barley. Um, yeah, it's... Um, Mainly it's a peanut. I don't get white cheddar at all. No, no, they're not bad. Mm -mm. Um, they do leave a little bit of a funky flavor in your mouth, but. I agree. I think. Uh, if not horrible. But. I would just be um, mindful if you're going to be talking to somebody up in their face, because I do think, although the garlic's not too overpowering, it is strong enough that. It's like a raw garlic. Yes. Those. I can't believe I forgot to tell you the calories. Those were 130 calories a piece. The Smoky Barbecue are 130 calories a piece. Maybe they're all 130. They're all 130 calories a piece. So Smoky Barbecue, uh, first ingredient again, roasted peanuts. But then we have sunflower seeds. We have tomato powder, molasses, onion powder, garlic powder, spice, vinegar, solids, natural flavor, natural smoke flavor. That one's better. Very smoky. Mm -hmm. I do get that little bit of a tomato flavor in there too. It's amazing that the smoke, it must be really potent because it's the last ingredient, but you really do taste it. Well, we buy liquid smoke when we're doing the ribs or mm -hmm. ribs. It's strong. I mean, you don't put much in there and you can taste that. I really like that. Yes, yeah, I like that too. I'm still not sure about the texture. I'm getting the barbecue flavor and the smoky flavor and there was a little bit of sweetness there i'm not getting any like heat so like no, spice heat there's no spice in that. no, no. Heat spices. um i really do like it what do you think about the texture that i get the peanuts but there's something else it's almost like there it's a piece of bread or something there's something else in there that's very crunchy it has to be the sunflower seeds i see those though there's something else like look at all these little see these it, little puffed it's the rice barley. things that's the barley well there's quite a bit in there it's okay. I don't dislike it. It's, it's kind of different. a, it's kind of a puffy. Um, That's why I was wondering if it was rice, like rice cereal in there. This is the everything bagel, and it is uh, roasted peanuts, rice flour, sunflower seeds, sugar, canola oil, salt, poppy seeds. Mm -hmm. I can actually see all those on this. Actually, better. Poppy seeds, uh, I can read it pretty good yeah. here. Barley, um, dehydrated time. onion, dehydrated garlic, natural flavor. Mm. It smells a lot like the first one. Okay. So, that smells similar to the first yeah. one. Yeah. 
Yeah, it's funny how that first one did not have That's any white cheddar flavor. 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 That one's the first one. I like the texture. That one seems to be a little softer than the other two. I mean, it's still crunchy, but it seems to be looser put together. Like the other ones are really densely packed, crunchy. These, this is kind of looser. I like that. I don't know if I'd ever say everything bagel. I wouldn't have said everything bagel because everything bagel usually is stronger. It's a stronger flavor. That is not as strong as your typical everything bagel. Mm -hmm. If they had put more of everything in it. Yeah, um, like bumped up the level a little bit. Yeah. It needed more garlic. It needed more onion, more poppy seeds. It needed more of all the spices to make it a really good everything bagel. That being said, I do like it. Um, I like it quite a bit, and I do like the texture of it. It, um, to me, it was, uh, you said it was softer. It was like looser. It's it looser. Necessarily lo it's looser, but it's not soft. It's, it's not crunchy. soft at all. It's still okay. very crunchy. But I mean, you said soft, and I'm like, it's not soft. It's not. It's, it's just crunchy. like the other two are really densely packed. This one seemed to be the pieces weren't held together as tightly. Right. And I you can another, see the poppy seeds, but yeah, I didn't get any. You didn't really taste them. Mm -hmm. um, I tried another one of those bites of cheese. It has that little bit of a funky cheese flavor. Right. But, so you do get a little bit of that. No. That's the only bad thing is the white cheddar one, even though it doesn't necessarily scream cheese. It does. That's the only one of the three that kind of leaves a funky after flavor. I think it's the cheese. But yeah, <laughs> the, the smoky barbecue and the everything bagel do not have that mm -hmm. at all. So no. it has to be the cheese. Um, but the smoky barbecue and the everything bagel are the only ones that I would buy. Again, I wouldn't buy the cheese. I agree. Because I don't care for that funky aftertaste. No, the question for me is, would I rather have this over another savory snack? No. Well, like what are you- I would much rather like have what? chips. Some kind of barbecue well, chips. Well, these are peanuts. Kevin uh, and I flavored both- Flavored peanuts. I'd rather have flavored peanuts in there. We both like the peanuts that you can get in a sleeve and you can just eat a sleeve of peanuts. The cocktail peanuts, those, uh, yeah, I, I would just as soon have those as one of these. Mm -hmm. Well, they, and they make savory flavored peanuts, like barbecue peanuts. Oh, yeah, like oh, yeah. Tons expensive. of, yeah, absolutely, um, yeah. I would rather have those than these. Mm -hmm. These are maybe more convenient, but I still would rather I like the, the pure peanut flavor with a uh, little bit of flavoring attached to it. Right. Mm -hmm. Um, I think it's cool. I think it's neat that they're offering something different. So oh, there's definitely a market for that. I, I think so too. I think because you can put not only one of these in your lunch, but then you can put one of their sweet Nature Valley bars in your lunch if you want. Um, so I think it's nice. Um, it's not something that we would gravitate toward, mm -hmm. but a lot of people probably will. Now, for $4.29, of course, that was at Kroger. You might be able to find them somewhere else cheaper. Which one box are you picking? Uh, probably the barbecue, because it had the most flavor. I think I'm going for the barbecue too. Slow, uh, uh, closely followed by the everything bagel. Mm -hmm. I, that was close, because I really do like it. It's just not strong enough. Yeah. But the smoky barbecue has the most flavor. It does, and the cheese would be good if it didn't have leave that little bit of the funky aftertaste, because I really do like the amount of garlic and stuff they have in them. I, I, I like that too. part of it. It just mm -hmm. leaves that little bit of a funky flavor in your mouth. Yeah. So these were at our Kroger. They were out front in the breezeway. They weren't even in the store on a display or anything. So there's no telling where you'll find them. You might have them on a display inside your store. You might find these with the other Nature Valley bars. I don't know. I know for our Kroger, it was weird. <laughs> it was very weird. It was like they didn't have room in the store. So we're just going to leave them out, you know, out when you right when you go in and actually it wasn't when you go in it was when we were leaving that we saw them so you know we almost missed them so i don't know where you're going to be able to find them i would look around the bar aldo you might get lucky okay. yeah so i will have a picture for you at the end and thanks for watching